And one of the things the Lord spoke to my heart for this new year is he said, Jason, you cannot limit what you're believing me to do in your life and in the life of Kingsway Church based on what you've seen me do in the lives of others and in the life of other churches in times past. And he told me something that may sound a little crazy to you, but he told me, you know, because I hasn't seen, ear hasn't heard, it has not yet entered in the hearts of man what God has prepared for those who love him, but he's revealed it to us by his spirit. And the Lord told me, he said, if I have seen it, I've got better for you. He said, if I have seen it, that's not what I have for you. That's one of the things we can't build here based on what works there. We can't do here what they do over there. We have to do here what God says to do here. Because I'm believing for what eye hasn't seen, ear hasn't heard, and has not yet entered in the hearts of man, what God has prepared. And I think there's a lot of things that, that God has done for others that would be good things for us, but they would not be the God thing for us. Because what the Lord spoke to me, and I wanted to preface it before I said it, because otherwise you could hear it in the wrong way. And so, as we're famous for saying, don't hear what I'm not saying. The Lord told me, he said, Jason, if I have seen it, it's not me for you in this season. Which is a good thing. Isn't it, Jim? See, because the temptation is, if I have seen it, to lean on the life experience of somebody else. Before you know it, we're weighted down with Saul's armor when we're sent out to fight a giant in the land. For too, oft, for too long, the body of Christ has shape-shifted to fit society instead of transforming society by the resident glory that is in the body of Christ. And allowing the world around us to dictate the hope within us. Instead of allowing the hope within us to prophesy to the world around us. 